Big Head, I need to talk to you about business. Oh, hi, Jerry. Hi, Jinyang. I was just uh, you know, taking a little walk down memory lane. You stay or go, this is not interesting to me. Big Head, we need to kick Wart out of the incubator. Oh, really? I thought we liked Wart. Oh, damn it. Wart? Wart has a very good idea, very good software. But when I ask her for business plan, she doesn't have a business plan. She's a brilliant coder, but this is not a charity. She's also not a very friendly. It's a bad for the vibe. This place should be a cool hang. Uh, I got you some new cans, by the way. Thank you, big head. Nice. I, I didn't mean it, okay? I, I'm sorry, Guard, I didn't mean it. You keep her name out of your skink, you little mouth. You little, little bitch! Hey, 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 this is a place of business! Oh my god, don't shoot me! Jared! Jared! No, don't, don't play a brick or one, motherfucker! Jared! Get shit! And what about a uh, restraining order? Can I, I take one out against myself on his behalf? No. What if I threaten you guys? Just hear me out. Fucking pigs, I, I hope that you get cheated out of your overtime. How about that, dickless? Maybe you could just try calling the guy. Why were you talking to the police? Oh, it was just a personal issue. You should not bring him here. Fuck the police. Jin Ying, you're not doing anything illegal here, are you? Yes. Where is everyone? Come on. 警察走了，我要去干活。出来，来，全部给我出来，快点，快点，快点。Jerry is bringing chaos to the house, and chaos is a bad for our business. Yeah. What is our business? I told you, it's a better for both of us if you do not know. Oh right, yeah. We need to get rid of Guard. It's the only way to get rid of Jerry. <laughs> Guard. Yes. Uh, what, no? I mean, yes, but I barely mentioned it. Did you call her sexy? Yes or no? I think I was more talking about her tech. So you told Gavin Belson, a lion in repose, that Guart was a potential threat, and now Jin Yang is selling us to him for pocket change. Jin Yang can do that? Yeah. He owns 60% of the company. He can do whatever he wants. Gavin is shutting us down, Richard. Guart is so mad she won't even look at me. Ah, oh, fuck. You know, if you want revenge on me, that's fine. But to go after Guart? She doesn't have your savvy or your ruthlessness, Richard. Hell, she has to wear earplugs on hikes because the forest is too loud. Look, I was only talking to Gavin to save Pied Piper. I, I had no idea he was a monster? Of course you did. That's all you talked about for years. Gavin is a monster. Who let her in? I take one lousy shit. Jin Yang? What is going on here? All girls are coding camp. I support a woman. Mr. Eric, I'm finished. This diet cream helped my husband lose weight. He was fat fuck, now he not. Five star, the end. I wrote exactly like Mr. Eric told me to. It's very good, Sophie. Very good. You're using underage girls as slave labor for a fake Amazon review farm? Yes. And, and you're using the Pied Piper name? Yes. It's okay. I have money. Oh. Girls, call your parents. Don't mess with Pied Piper again, you little fucker. Hello? Jin Ying, hey, hey, uh, what's going on, boss man? Oh, yeah. It's uh, Richard Hendricks from Pied Piper. How's it going, dude? Very bad. My underage girl slaves all left. Oh, yeah, totally. Bummer. Well, you'll find them. Anyway, kind of a silly question. Um, you know how you stole the Pied Piper source code? Yes. Yeah, and then you rewrote it into what is now Yownet? Yes. Right. Um, did the Chinese government, by any chance, require you to add a back door? Yes, I have an SSH key in my house written down. Cool. Wow. Uh, <laughs> I don't suppose I could get that from you. 
uh, it's just that Pied Piper is in kind of a jam. Yes. Pied Piper. Your white witch just shut down my business. Hey, Richard, what's up? Jingyang, please. Monica, for the last five years, you have been horrible. You never smile. You never kiss me. I'll never give you anything you want. I hate you. Jingyang, I need that key. There's a key? Okay, let's, let's just be reasonable. Thanks. You and I, we could have run this town, but uh, you blew it, mister. Jin Yang won the house for me in a game of chance. He told me to pick a number between one and ten. I picked seven, um, but it was three. Mm, you live, you learn. Um, Richard, I'm not sure if you caught it. Congratulations. It's your very close friend, Jin Yang. And I would like you to give me free shares of a Pi Piper. Okay, Jin Yang. Uh, well, you had plenty of opportunity to invest. Still do. Yeah, you could buy Piper coin. Monica, two men are talking of business. You can find your broom and fly away. Suit yourself. I checked the ledger and the coin we issued to Ehrlich was just sold for $20 million. Richard, is the main lady right? Eric is now fat and rich? Uh, yeah, I guess. Where is he? I don't know. Tibet still, maybe? Okay. Tibet. Okay. Are you Ehrlich Bachman? Yes, I'm Eric Bachman. I can show you ID. That's my face. I was a fat, but now I'm a not fat. I'm sorry, this is supposed to be you? I have an idea. Okay, whoa, 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 who